I realized I can't grab on to what's next unless I completely let go of this. So the only way to truly move on is just to drop the mic. So with that, Casey Neistat has finally decided to stop vlogging. I have following this guy since 2014 while he ha only has less than 20,000 subscribers. And I have seen his progress from that amount of subscribers up till now, 5.8 million subscribers up till today. That's a very amazing progress within I think within two years. I wish I can do that, but no, this guy is amazing. Since his style of filming has been uh, emulated by a lot of people online, and I have too, so since he dropped his mic, I'm gonna drop something too. Two. The mouse. Actually, I'm not even gonna miss him because he's still gonna post video. What am I gonna miss him for? He's coming back for a couple days. But one thing you gotta admit though, I am gonna miss the notification that I get from him for posting his everyday vlog every single morning. I'm pretty sure the entire YouTube community is gonna miss him. So a few things that I would like to point out why I like about his video is it's super creative, storytelling is great. He's creative, a great storyteller, uh, super dedicated to get every single uh, unique shot possible. Did yeah, I left out anything? This guy takes vlogging to an extreme level. Getting the shots that no one would ever thought of. Putting cameras everywhere. In the airport, in the restroom. You name it. There's a lot of shots that he got. I would say I wouldn't bother to waste my time to get it. Ben, what do you think about Casey Stop Vlogging? What's your thoughts on it? No thoughts, because I don't watch his videos. <laughs> <laughs> this guy also makes really good analogy. Swinging from vine to vine, and grabbing on to that next opportunity, that next vine, to take me closer to where I want to be. And the trouble with success is that it makes you very comfortable. That kind of success says to me, good, just keep doing what I'm doing right now. This success will continue. But that means holding on to that one vine in the jungle for what's next and and the more I thought about like how am I going to progress my career how am I going to figure out what's how is my career going to evolve how am I going to figure out what's next in my career the more I realize I have to first let go of this vine before I can grab on to what's next you must be Tarzan so whether if you're a fan or not I just want to share this with you he really inspired me to do vlogging and some other video too. I actually never thought of uh, vlogging can be that uh, sophisticated. Taking different angle, different shots, unique shot, unique angle, and then, yeah, transition and shit. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Air France flight 639 to Charles de Gaulle is paging all passengers. Up. May I have your attention, please? Will the following British Airways 194 passengers please proceed immediately to gate D? So, having him stop vlogging daily definitely gonna take the internet by the storm. I just think it's a it's 
pretty sad that he stopped vlogging. For those people who's crying over Casey's uh, stopping daily vlog, just quit it, man. He's coming back with more quality content. Actually, for me, I'm kind of excited for uh, looking forward for his new content in a couple days, actually. It's Christmas, by the way.